selfish penalties costing everybody we killed eight minutes of penalties that i can count in a penalty shot it's unacceptable if you guys do this against or you do it against we're going to be in here down for nothing game two was definitely not as smooth for us as the first game the first game we kind of walked in and we were right all over them from the jump and we basically kept through it for the rest of that game and then the second game we had a little bit of a rough start eight minutes and a penalty shot that already cuts out half of your period of having a chance, a chance to play offense. None of those penalties to me needed to be taken. This is why we have this weekend. For you guys to learn from that. You need to learn from that. Because if you do that next weekend, and you go out there and coast around like you did that period, next weekend, you will get shit pumped. Uh, those was my first junior game, so uh, I was pretty nervous, um, just like anybody, but I was just ready to get out there, get my feet under me. I don't care what our roster looks like on a piece of paper. It doesn't matter what it looks like on a piece of paper if you're gonna go out there and take it for granted and think it's f***ing pointless. I expect an attitude adjustment because that period was not good. That was not good. You guys got 10 shots and half of them were from the f***ing blue line of perimeters. Shit happens in a game. You're not gonna pitch a 60 minute game. It doesn't happen every time. But we need to be better when we have a bad shift, when we have a bad instance. We need to erase. It can't be contagious. My mindset going into the exhibition games was, you know, just trying to make plays, but don't try to do anything outside the box or try to stay inside the lines, if you will. This is my first game for the Ogden Mustangs, and right now it's, it's a game that I need to prove who I am, what I can show to coach, and become an outstanding player for the team. I understand it's preseason, but I expect 110% every time you go on the ice. You're not just going to be handed shifts anymore, guys. Preseason, yes, we're meant to feel it out. Now that we're getting into the season, you will not be handed anything. Sorry, but if you want handouts, go to a different f***ing team. This period, earn it. Earn our win so when we come back in here, we're feeling good about how we fixed our problem after the second period. 20 minutes, 20 miles, 20 miles. <laughs> I really wanted this to show the Ogden fans that we're way better than last year and we're going to be a competitor for nationals. For me, winning a national championship has got to be the, it's the creme de la creme. I mean, everybody wants it. We just got to have it that much more than everybody else. My 16U year of uh, youth hockey made it all the way to the national final and just let it slip so I kind of know what it's like at a youth level, but it's going to be that much harder going up against 20-year-olds. <laughs>